everyone. Happy, happy Thursday. I wanted to uh, come on very quickly to show you some very quick and simple DIYs uh, that I uh, did for Valentine's Day. And they're all very, very simple, very easy to do. I don't think a tutorial is really uh, needed, but just wanted to uh, share some ideas uh, with you all, um, just in case you wanted to um, give it as gifts or make very quick, simple uh, decor for your house. So um, these items can actually all be bought either at like Target or Dollar Tree. Um, the first item that I wanted to share was this um, mason jar filled with uh, sweetheart candy. So uh, this jar, you can get it at Dollar Tree, only a dollar, and then you can get the sweethearts um, as well for a dollar each at Dollar Tree, and you would need two packs of them. Um, filling in two packs would actually leave you with some left. So it turned out really cute, very colorful, and what I did was um, I added uh, this uh, sticker. I got this pack of stickers from the Target Dollar Spot, and um, it's really nice and crafty so I thought it matched really well um, with the jar and then I added uh, some of this uh, baker's twine you can also get this at Dollar Tree as well or Target and uh, put it together kind of like as a gift item or display. This was also part of the same um, sticker set and it says hugs and kisses and XO. Um, I like that because it looked like the shape of the sweetheart itself. So this was really simple to make. I mean, it's not hard at all. It just makes it more uh, colorful from a decor. Uh, standpoint. So um, I went ahead and made that. Um, the second um, item that I put together was this um, heart glass bowl of these um, soap petals that you can also get at the Dollar Tree. It actually smells really nice and um, this uh, you can get in the candle section. You, you can get this heart shaped tray in the candle section at Dollar Tree. Um, you can also get these um, sets of the rose petals at Dollar Tree as well. It comes in different colors. Um, I got it one in the um, pink one and one in the red one and just mixed it like this. So you can either lay it flat like this, um, you could put it in your bathroom or on the table, just wherever um, you would like to put the decor, or you could kind of um, stand it sideways like that if you kind of want it to be um, in this uh, profile where you see the roses, kind of like a piece of art <laughs> in a way. So I thought these rose petals are actually very pretty. They actually make very nice decor items and they smell really nice as well. So that one's very simple, easy to make um, as well, and you can get all of those again at the Dollar Tree. Um, this frame I actually showed in one of my last uh, DIY videos um, for the frames that I made. And I wanted to share this again because this I think is perfect for Valentine's Day, although you can use it um, all year round. I got this white frame at Dollar Tree and um, it's very pretty. It has this uh, trim here that makes it look very romantic, very girly, um, and yet a very simple white color. Um, these, uh, studs, gem studs, were also at Dollar Tree as well. Um, I know they sold out really quick, but for those of you um, who do have these, these are so easy to do because they all peel off as one strip. So it's not like I had to stick each of the dots individually. That's what I really loved about those um, stickers. So I alternated between the pink and the silver. Okay, so it adds some color to it um, and it matches. And then these are also the um, sticker, the puffy stickers that are uh, shaped like a heart with some rose um, pattern on it. These were also at Dollar Tree as well. Um, I actually got them last year. I think they have them this year as well, but they're like stickers and um, kind of like silky material, but they're very, very pretty. So I kind of alternated between the pink and the red one. And then on top, I just added like a a felt uh, ribbon. Um, I got those at uh, Michael's. So this is also very, very easy um, to make, and I just thought it looks really cute from a decor standpoint. Um, and then lastly, just really quickly wanted to um, give an idea in terms of how you can um, display your Valentine's uh, cards or pictures in general. Um, I know a lot of people have started doing this, and I thought of um, doing it as well because it looks so cute. And um, you can use a cork board. You can buy a cork board. Um, I actually got mine at Daiso, but you can actually get it at probably um, office supply store. I think um, Dollar Tree might have smaller versions of it, but of course the bigger the better. Um, and then you're going to need, of course, the baker's twine 
Again, um, you're going to need some of these um, pins, and then uh, you can put pretty much anything. I got these um, card stickers, uh, these cardstock, um, actually at Typo. It's a stationery store, and I thought these were so cute and kind of Valentine's Day uh, like. And um, these little clips um, are actually from Target, the dollar spot as well. So I alternated between the red hearts and the white hearts, and just kind of put the pictures of like um, you know the sweet and the hearts and um, these cute little like um, you know heart-shaped motifs that remind me of Valentine's Day. This is also a great way if you want to hang up your little Valentine's. Um, I actually got this Valentine card from uh, Kiara, um, Mrs. Cotton Candy. So thank you so much Kiara. That is so so sweet of you. So um, I put that in the middle right here. Um, but let's say you had a bunch of these. You can also hang them together as a set. Um, it probably looks nice as a set. Um, if you have those Polaroid or Instax cameras you can hang your pictures there. Um, I just wanted to make it kind of like a Valentine's Day theme. So I hung those at top. And of course, to leave the bottom not so plain, I put um, two of the bigger cards that have some sparkle to it. I also got these at the Target um, dollar spot. They're just so, so pretty. And I just love the colors and the glitter that um, it has. So just wanted to give you guys an idea in case you wanted to know um, how to display your Valentine's cards or other cards or pictures um, in general. Just kind of do it like a laundry um, line like that. So again, it's also very easy to make. It doesn't take much time at all and you can change it um, all year round. So I uh, just wanted to uh, share that with all of you and again it's super easy to make. I hope um, that gave you some good ideas and that you enjoyed this video. I'll talk to you all very very soon in my next video and if I don't talk to you before then I just wanted to say happy Valentine's Day uh, to all of you and hope you have a wonderful day with your um, special someone. Have a great one. Bye-bye.